Tonight's job is to prepare this Hyper 9 motor for install in the 1969 Carmen Ghia, Carmen Electra. The first thing we have to do is install the output shaft adapter, the bell housing adapter, the pressure plate, the flywheel, and the clutch. So the first piece we need to install is this spacer ring. This, this ring's job is to position the output shaft adapter and the clutch at the right depth for the bell housing. It just slides on. Next thing is this output shaft adapter. It has a quarter inch key. Just slides in there. Then we put this on. And it's important to get this on straight. So what I usually do is just kind of get it there. I'll tap it just a little bit. Now I'll use this tool I made, just a piece of flat stock with a hole drilled in the middle, a piece of all thread, a couple washers to allow it to spin, and it's this is 5 16 18, which will thread into the output shaft of the motor. Now, just a half inch wrench, and I'm going to pull this on straight as I can here. All right, now we're just gonna pull it on by tightening this piece of all thread. So just pull it on there and keep doing this until it hits the spacer. Two hours later. So I'll take this out and the output shaft adapter is installed. All right, last step for the output shaft adapter is the set screw. Put it in there. I put a little bit of Loctite on it, the blue stuff, so it doesn't stick forever. All right, so the next part I need to put on is the output shaft adapter. Um, this piece is what adapts the motor to the transmission bell housing. You notice it's indexed. It has the same size hole here as on the motor face. So that way it fits on just perfect. And it uses these. Now this is the uh, EV West uh, Volkswagen adapter kit. All right, next up is the flywheel. This is aluminum flywheel from EV West. Uh, aluminum flywheel is highly recommended on electric conversion. It takes a lot of weight off the face of the motor. gives you better acceleration. You don't need the inertia like you would need on a gas engine. So the nice thing is on this one is you don't have to worry about where the holes line up because they are equidistant because this is not a balanced flywheel. I didn't mention I already pressed in the pilot bushing. All right, so I am tightening flywheel bolts. Next, we're going to install the clutch disc and pressure plate. <coughs> so we'll use a clutch alignment tool. Through. The clutch alignment tool lines a clutch up with a pilot bushing. Disrepair. Is that you really had to Dan, go? cut all this out, please. <laughs> all right. On today's episode of Disrepair, I proved that I actually don't know what I'm doing. <laughs>